Finally done editing that video. I need to make a new to-do list for the day. I've been really enjoying writing my to-do list down because um, it's really, really satisfying to like cross it out and I just have more time. And now my to-do list is full of creative stuff because I don't start my summer classes till June 5th. So I'm gonna do that now. There is nothing better than marking off something off your to-do list I just marked off two like that is so exciting and then once it's like done like I feel just so fulfilled it's like those little wins that you get every day I heard that in a podcast one time and I really really liked that 500 reps in 10 minutes is she joking you guys I told my friends from home that I would do the Chloe Ting shredded summer workout challenge and so I was just like, oh, let me just like watch the video she posted today for the workout. And she's like, we're going to be doing 500 reps in 10 minutes. Like what? <sighs> All right, guys. So things have taken a turn. It's 1240 p.m. I have a call at one for like podcast stuff. And Delaney and I just decided we're going to do this Chloe Ting challenge together. We're just going to do the ab portion of her summer shred challenge. So like every day. She's post, I think for like four weeks, she's doing like a summer shred challenge where she posts a full body workout, a back workout, ab workout, and like stretches with it. But Delaney and I are just going to do the abs every day because we both like do our other own workouts, like our spin and stuff, so it's like not a big deal. So we're going to do a Zoom. Hey! We're going to do Zoom. I'm explaining to the vlog right now what we're doing. So we're going to do a Zoom. We're going to do it together so like we like pressure each other. So, hi. You we're gonna keep each other accountable. Yes, that's right. I just like threw on a workout outfit. I have my little um mat right here. See, I don't have a mat. This was an issue, but that'll be fine. Woo! Woo! This will help to lift body with this That's the workout, guys. Hope your abs feel completely smashed. <laughs> Dude! Uh, the ones that hurt my abs. I was just the side ones were hard for me, like the side planks. Now calling Brooke to prep for our call. Hello. <laughs> okay, so I'm having Brooke look at my bananas. She goes, let me see. So when can I? No, they need to, they need to get a little more brown. Okay, like pretty they brown? Be, they need to be pretty, pretty on the way out like, like nearly trash ready like, really like oozing not like oozing <laughs> but pretty bad okay guys brooke and i are had our call and now we're chatting oh wait i already showed you guys her so you know we're chatting well we're still chatting yeah, we're here and i'm uploading and then i decided i was gonna eat leftover pizza and brooke and i decided i shouldn't do that <laughs> so i'm gonna have these trader joe's pot stickers so i'm kind of going off i'm gonna add a little soy sauce to my rice here i'm really happy i already had that rice made mood ever <laughs> okay guys so i just got like everything done on my to-do list that i wanted to this morning like computer stuff i just wanted to get out of the way because as the day goes on if you guys saw my last vlog i made the clean with me vlog when i sat down to do stuff on my computer like later in the day it just like wasn't it like i needed to go outside like i needed like i was just so tired by that point so i got it all done with and now and i got my workout done now we're going to party i'm kidding we're gonna go to target um i have like a ton of things that i've been like making a list of that i wanted to get at target and i'm just like trying to minimize the amount of times i'm going to the grocery store going to target just like any sort of public place anyways i have a list of like really random stuff that i want to get at target i want to get a yoga mat or some sort of mat because doing that workout this morning without a mat was not it. my leggings got a little dirty um oh my little fake tripod i made is not good i'm gonna get some sort of cheap workout mat i feel like i could like benefit from it in the future anyways um and i'll just like throw it under my bed just something to like do these ab workouts on i get like a beach towel for like laying out um i want to get what else oh i want to get baskets my big thing is i want to get some organizational stuff because if you guys didn't see my last clean with me video um my closet is like well okay you can't really tell but it's like really really empty 
and I'm still working on organizing it, but a lot of this is coming obviously back home with me whenever I do decide to go home, um, which is gonna be really, really helpful. But then I'm also um, organizing this a lot more. Like I wanna be, I want things to be less exposed, if that makes sense, so it just like looks more organized. So I'm gonna get, I have three organizational baskets up there. So I wanna find some more that I can use for the rest of the shelves. And I wanna get some bathroom stuff. My bathroom is super unorganized with all my products. So I'm just gonna like see honestly what they have. Um, and if there's not much, like whatever, but I just wanted to try. Um, and I, want, I need toilet paper, you know, just like random little things. So we're gonna do a little Target trip. And I'm really excited. It's kind of the highlight of my day. So let's go. Out for the day. I just kept on my set because I just really, really like this. I'll link it down below. It's from Revolve. I love it. And then I just have this tied around my waist because I just don't want to wear like a shirt. But I feel like there's a lot of midriff showing to like go to Target. So I'm just kind of wearing this, you know, it's kind of a slick style. Um, this black and Nike hat. My hair is in a bun. So I'm going to shower later and like put on makeup later probably. And then if I want, I guess I don't have to. Um, and then my Adidas Falcon sneakers, I'll try and link them down below as well. They've been selling out a lot of places, but I think I found a place they've been selling them. And then I'm going to wear my belt bag as well. So let's go. Just a quick shout out to my TikTok. I may or may not have just made a TikTok right before leaving. Um, I really do enjoy the tick of the talks. So follow me at Danielle underscore Carolyn. But I just learned the rock star dance last night and I just did it. And I'm really excited. So... Go give it a like if you're feeling the love. Um, TikTok's fun, you know? Still no toilet paper. What am I gonna do? Alrighty, we just got back from Target. I kind of vlogged a lot of things that I picked up, but I'll just do like a little haul. Um, so as you guys saw, they didn't have any toilet paper at all. I think I just have to go first thing in the morning, but I got these and they kind of show them being used as toilet paper if you want. So they're like these little Kleenex things. I just got this one beach towel for, um, laying out. You guys know I've been walking to this like grassy area. Um, and it would just be nice to have like a towel or, um, I just wanna, I just really wanted, I just don't have a beach towel here to like lay out in. Stack and carry, it's got two layers to it and I'm going to put this under my sink in my bathroom to put any products just to like organize it a lot more. I just thought this was perfect because it kind of has organization within itself. I always have to go to the Target candle section. They have just such yummy candles. Um, and I just got one. I got this eucalyptus candle. I love the smell of eucalyptus and like Delaney has this one that smells so good. A ton of random like organizational little bins to put in the drawers of my bathroom so I'll be like vlogging that whenever I organize it but I got um, two of these plastic ones these are just for like hair ties or products or just kind of skincare organize it however I'm gonna and then I just got this one for like random like makeup brushes or what have you we'll see as for bins for my shelf I picked these um, I'm stupid and didn't like take a picture of my shelf beforehand or anything I just kind of like went into it like whatever, but I'm really happy with these. So I got six of them and they're really cute. They're from the brand Project 62. They're just these storage baskets. They're like a felt kind of grayish taupe color. I thought they went pretty well with my room and I got six, so two on each. So two, four, six and there's, yeah, so it's perfect. So not every shelf is gonna have them, but I didn't want that. Cause like one shelf I have my jewelry and then another shelf I have like perfume and stuff. So I don't need them for that. So I think I got the perfect amount, which is crazy. And then lastly, I got this set as well. It's literally called a drawer organizer and it has like this little square one and then two rectangular ones and they're stackable obviously, which is really nice. So I should be an organized queen after this. <laughs> Gonna light this bad boy right now, get it started. Listening to Kenzie and Taylor's podcast together and I decided I'm going to get started on this shelf right here. Um, and yeah, I'm just gonna go through it, you know, throw some stuff away, but most of it I'm pretty much just keeping. I just wanna like organize it a little bit better um, and start adding the baskets, so let's do it. So that literally took me like five to seven minutes. Like that was so easy. 
Basically, I started, then I realized I should probably wipe everything down because everything was a little dusty. So I used some disinfectant wipes. And I actually just replaced this. It was this that says you got this. And I had this just like laying on the shelf because I guess Delaney and I bought it for our gallery wall and it just didn't work. So it's all the different types of coffees and like, well, espressos, I guess. Um, but yeah, I put that there for now. I think I'm going to keep it. I like it. It's something new. But yeah, I feel like this just looks so much better. It's more of an organized chaos now, if you will. Um, I have two bins. This one has like batteries and like random stuff. This one has like a ton of um, jewelry and random little bags. These I kind of just didn't touch, but I have like belts, sunglasses, and just random stuff. I really like this one. This one's cute. <laughs> I have all my perfume, um, this little Fendi bag that I, when I got my wallet, um, and then these two stones. Here's my jewelry organizer. I love it. I'll link it down below for you guys. I love it. It's a felt jewelry organizer. I just like being able to see everything. It's so nice. I already had this. I just popped that next to it. Down here we have more bins. Um, I have two books here. I used to be obsessed with coffee table books. So I've got these two right here. And then this is a fun little bin. I've got all my candles, my incense holder and sticks, a sunstone my mom gave me. When you hold it, it has a very positive effect, they say. And then I have some essential oils back there. And here we got sanitation station. I've got all my masks and a little thing of hand sanitizer. And then this one's fun. These are all my game day buttons and stickers and hopefully I'll be able to wear them in the fall. Oh. So yeah, that's kind of just a little layout of this. I think it turned out really, really good. And I'm Really excited about it. That was easy. All right, I'm on a roll, so I think I'm gonna huh, tackle the bathroom. I'm just, mm, I'm not excited about this, fam. I just, mm. so I'm gonna do my best. My main goal is this area. This is stuff that I brought with me from home, and I'm not gonna be here forever, so I'm not gonna like fully unpack. So I don't really know that. I honestly might stay there, but like I need to go through this and all the products, and then all these drawers are obviously like super unorganized so that's why I have those different bins but yeah first I'm just gonna take a trash bag and just kind of go through the products because I have like random unfinished stuff just the so yeah let's get started <laughs> Okay, so that was pretty easy. Um, I basically just cleared out these. There was like so many like random like dusted, there's so many random dusty things, like old deodorants, like so gross. So down here now I have just like a ton of sheet masks, one face mask, some cotton pads, that random plant. And then I have some bath bombs, some lotions, and like a body mist. Um, this, what are in these baskets could change depending on like how all this organization goes. But this was like the easiest one. So obviously you start with the easy part, right? Now I am going to, honestly, I think I'm going to go through under my sink first because that's just like the most cluttered um, and then go from there. All right, organization is on the come up. Um, I am decided I'm not going to use this under there anymore. I'm going to use this instead. It's just a lot more practical. Um... I'm going to see if I can find a place to use this. Honestly, I might pop it under my desk so I can put, like, random tech stuff in. Not sure, because it is, like, a good little system I got from Amazon. But, yeah, so this is the stacking. This top one, I'm just going to put, like, you know, band-aids, just random stuff like that. And then the bottom one, I have, like, travel products and just, like, random things. So I'm going to now uh, stack it over top. Maybe I'll get nifty and make some labels eventually, but not for now. Um, and so yeah, it's all together. Put it under there. Oh my god, it's just so much more sleek and it literally fits more than that. So, highly suggest those. Wow, I could have even gotten a stack. Of, actually, no, I don't think I could have. So, <laughs> anyways, um, yeah, I have this random little toothbrush thing. And then obviously. You know how it goes. We've got the Femme Care. And then we have a couple little makeup bags that I'll pop on top. Wow, this just looks so much better. And then you guys know I'm suffering a thumb injury from cutting a bagel. And so I actually do need to keep these band-aids and all of its accoutrements just right out front. Normally I'd probably just put them in there. So yeah, wow, that looks so much better. And again, it literally took me like... Well, I started this podcast episode, so it took me 15 minutes about, so that wasn't bad. I had to clear a lot of trash out, but yeah, wow, I feel so, yay! <laughs> 
Okay, so I went ahead and cleaned up my counter a little bit. Um, I just moved these two. This is my makeup and this is like my daily skincare. Um, normally they were right here and I just was like, that could totally just go right there. Like, looks so clean. I just cleaned like my toilet and stuff and like surface cleaned like all my cabinets, everything like that. My sink. Need to clean my mirror though. Nasty. Um, so yeah, I just have my hand wash here. All my little toothbrush stuff, but I haven't organized these drawers yet. I'm going to take Good a morning, you guys. It's the next day. I just went and got Starbucks. It just reopened, and basically you just, like, order it mobile to go, and then you just go pick it up. So I did it. It's so exciting. Pulling out my podcast stuff because I'm going to be on Tori D. Simone's podcast, not her manifest one. She has two podcasts. I'm going to be on her stride effect podcast which is pretty much all about stride but not only stride like also like just being a spin instructor and i'm really excited to be on it um because i am a spin instructor and i love her and i just can't wait to chat about all things spin so obviously when the episode comes out i'll let you guys know but yeah that's kind of the vibe um i'm wearing my prevello jacket actually and yeah i guess i need my headphones I've been really into making this little table my desk. I, I don't know why. It's just been a thing. <laughs> I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Yeah. Just finished recording with Tori. That was so, so much fun. We talked all things spin, kind of how I started my journey at Pure Bello. And then we started talking about, like, relatable, like, spin things. I think you guys will really enjoy it. It was, like, really fun. We talked about, like self tanning or getting spray tans even though like you spin and like wearing makeup versus not like just like random stuff but like she's just such a good friend of mine so it was so much fun to like do a podcast legit all about spin but like also just like have pal time so it was really good um yeah i have like a lot to do on my computer and then i'm probably or do i want to organize now because i want to finish you know doing my drawers i don't know we'll see all right guys, so I have been in front of my computer for the last two hours now, and now it's time to do some more cleaning, which I know is probably why you guys are watching this vlog. So I'm gonna grab my kombucha, and we are going to head back into the bedroom. Um, I am like obsessed with organizing. Like I, I'm sad that after my bathroom I'm kind of done. I guess I can come up with some more projects, um, but for now this is like the main focus. Next up, what we are going to do is basically take out everything of these two drawers and I've got these organizers here and we're just going to organize a little bit better. I'm still just so happy with under the cabinet. Like I went to grab something earlier and I was like, whoa, it's so nice. Basically what I'm going to do is I just took one of these baskets from there. It had like two books in it, so no big deal. And I'm going to start going through this and just kind of taking things out and then re-adding in as um, I start organizing, if that makes sense. So this is kind of like my skincare slash like deodorant drawer, <laughs> I guess. Like, I think it has like some tooth, like just random, but mainly skincare, no makeup is in this drawer. Um, so yeah, let me just empty this out. Okay, so that took me like three minutes. Basically, that was really easy. I took out my face masks that I had in here and I put them in here since that's where I had my other sheet mask. So now all of my face masks are, are in there, which is so much easier. Here it's actually pretty simple because I do have this, which is like my daily skincare. And for now I'm leaving it as is um, because I'm like, you know, going home soon and like there's just no point. And I just like, like these two little things they are from Sephora collection. They're just like so perfect. But all my other skincare, this is stuff I do use every day too, I guess. But is all here. So I have moisturizer, some like random things, lip balm. I guess the lip balm would go there then too. And then here I have a couple hair ties that I'll probably add more to because I'm sure there's more down there. Here I have random tools. Um, so I obviously have more of those in here, but for now I'm just leaving it. Jade roller, eyelash thing, my uplift, like eyebrow razor, whatever, makeup wipes, and then deodorant. So that's good to go. This drawer is definitely gonna be a little bit more to go through. So now let's do this. This is like makeup. Well, I guess Q-tips could go elsewhere. Um, but then these are the other two things that I'm working with. Okay, again, this literally took me like three, four, five minutes. That was so hype, so easy. Um, so yeah, this is just a lot more organized, obviously. So I have like my skincare area and then I also have like my daily makeup, which I pretty much always just keep in a cosmetic bag because 
Not that I'm traveling right now, I guess, but like, I don't know. I just like, like to always have it like to go. So this is just kind of like all my like random extra stuff. So I put all my lip products in here. They fit perfectly. It's awesome. And it's just so much easier. I can just be like, oh, like what do I want to wear instead of like going like this? You guys are probably like, yeah, that's organizing. I just haven't like, I really just haven't had time to do all this. So I'm like kind of thankful I have the time to do this now. Um, these are like random face products, blush, primers, foundation, concealer, couple palettes, um, and then some setting sprays and I put the Q-tips back there.